Our Festival of Flight, which is our uh, migration festival, runs until the 18th of May. Um, but even after, depending on the, the season, you can have um, species moving through after that. Um, but basically the month of May is when they're out actively looking for mates and setting up territories and getting ready for the breeding season. We have, I think it's around 15, approximately 15 species of warblers that stay and nest in the park. Um, so the prothonotary warbler is, um, is one that does. They're a cavity nesting warbler. So they, they look for um, old woodpecker holes above the sloughs in the forest, so the swampy areas. Um, they stay and nest, um, black and whites, yellows, uh, yellow rumps you can see um, throughout the summer here in the park. Just the way the, the sand spit is set up, um, the birds just move north and if you're in the right spot on the right day, you can see the majority of those 35 to 40 species coming through. Like I said, we get a lot of the thrushes. Um, a lot of people like to look for them. Um, the orioles, the grosbeaks, beaks, um, indigo buntings, eastern bluebirds. Um, we have many species of woodpecker, from the pileated to the downy, the catbirds, eastern kingbirds. Um, a lot of the woodpeckers are here year round. Um, American woodcock are a really neat nocturnal bird um, that you can see during the spring they're doing courtship flights where you can watch them fly up trying to impress females. Um, that happens just after sunset and they stay in nest um, year round so you can see them with their young uh, later in the summer. Um, we have two species of resident owls that will nest here year-round, so screech owls and great horned owls. Um, what else? Um, so the festival is put on by the Friends of Rondo who help um, bring in our bird watcher and um, provide the birders breakfast and they um, help support all the the programs that we put on throughout the park um, during this time and the rest of the summer as well.